clothe yourselves with compassion, kindness, humility, gentleness, and patience. Bear with each other and forgive one another. If any of you has a grievance against someone, forgive as the Lord forgave you. And other, all these virtues put on love, which binds them all together in perfect unity. Love is patient, love is kind. It does not envy, it does not boast, it is not proud. It is not dishonor others, it is not self-seeking, it is not eagerly angered, it keeps no records of wrongs. I've ever met. She honestly would take a bullet for any one of her family or closest friends. When Elise tells you she's going to do something, she will get it done. When Elise tells you she's going to be somewhere, she will be there and probably 10 minutes early. She makes time for her family and friends and cherishes them. Elise and Kyle truly do complement each other. I feel like their core values are the same, and they both have such a strong respect and love for their families. And the coolest thing to me is that during five years that Elise and Kyle have been dating, Elise is the same Elise. She still makes time for her family and friends. She still has her spunky, feisty personality she even convinced Kyle to get a dog. <laughs> Which he totally loves right now, by the way. This really is a testament that Kyle is the right man for her. It's Kyle. We did not always get along as kids, but I would not go back and change that for anything because you're one of my best friends now. You're somebody that I can come to and talk to about anything, somebody who I can ask for advice, somebody that I can just call up when I need to laugh. And those are things that mean the world to me. And I love you, brother, and I wish you guys the very best. Elise, over the years that I've known you and gotten to know you better, I've seen what a positive impact you've had on Kyle. You've not only made him the most happy man I've seen in all the years that I've been around him, but I've seen you make him a better man, and not only that, but a better brother. And I want to thank you for that. For a while now, Elise, I've thought of you as family, and now today you really are family, and I couldn't be happier. Here's to you guys. I love you both. Dilly dilly. Dear friends and family, we are gathered here today to witness and celebrate the union of Elise and Kyle in marriage. Through their time together, they have come to realize that their personal dreams, hopes, and goals are more attainable and more meaningful through the combined effort and mutual support provided in love, commitment, and family. And so, they have decided to live together as husband and wife. These are the hands that even when wrinkled and aged will still be reaching for yours, still giving you the same unspoken tenderness with just a touch.
let's stay forward. For better or for worse. For richer. For poor. The sickness and death. To love and to cherish. I'm gonna stay forward. Until that to this point. Kyle, to be my husband, to have and to hold, from this day forward, for better or for worse, for richer, for poor, <laughs> in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish, from this day forward, until death to us part. By the power vested in me by the state of Florida, I pronounce you husband and wife. Kyle, kiss your bride. Family and friends, it gives me great pleasure to present to you for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Kyle and Elise Hill. First of all, thank to everybody on, on the Hauk family, uh, on our side, all their friends, for sharing this time with us and with them on this uh, new adventure that they're getting involved in it. Uh, I'd like to wish them 
many, 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 many years uh, together. We love you guys both. We're so proud of you. I'm excited for the journey that you're on, like I said last night. You'll have some challenges, but it's also going to be a good, good run. So thank you, everybody, for being here. God, God bless you all. We love you. Thank you. So I'm so excited to be able to share this moment with you both and can't wait to see and be part of what the future holds. I love you both, and let's raise our glasses to a beautiful bride and groom. So I got a couple things to say to both of them. Uh, Elise, I'll start with you. I don't know how you put up with him, because <laughs> he can be a real pain in the ass. But, <laughs> but he's a good dude, and you make him happy, and that's the most important thing. And as we've gotten to know you, and uh, as you've been around for a while now, you know, we've gotten to see how special you are and how awesome a person you are. And um, I'm just so happy to officially welcome you to the family. Uh, you know, when Kyle first asked Zach and I to be his best man, two thoughts ran across my mind. The first was, what an honor. And the second was, wow, Kyle must really not have any friends. <laughs> All jokes aside though, Kyle, ever since we were young, I've always looked up to you and tried to be like you. And over the years, you've taught me a lot, and I've learned so much from being around you. I'm truly blessed to have you as a brother. I couldn't ask for a better brother than you, except for maybe Zach, 